Welcome to the video and welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, we're currently doing a 31 day film challenge where every day for 31 days we are being challenged to pick some of our favorite movies, favorite actors, favorite soundtracks, all that kind of stuff. Today we got a fun one. Actually, it's a little bit scary thinking about it. But before we get into it, let's get this intro out of the way and jump right in. Welcome once again. I'm trying to keep these videos as short as possible, so with that in mind, my name's Austin. This channel is all about digging deeper and going further to better understand faith in film and everything that is in between. If that sounds interesting to you, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can come back tomorrow as we continue the series. Today we are talking about the scariest movie I've watched. Now, the ones that I go through on here, some of you might say those aren't super scary. And that's because I've only gotten into the horror genre and more scary movies in the past year or two, so there's a lot I still have to catch up on. So that's my disclaimer if you knock any of my picks. Before I give you my options and choice that I went through, make sure to comment down below with your pick for the scariest movie that you've watched. First, this is one I was recently introduced to just a couple months ago, Pan's Labyrinth. I loved this movie. Guillermo del Toro does some of the best monster makeup in all of Hollywood, and he's one of the best directors working today. Pan's Labyrinth is a great film, but it wasn't my pick for the scariest movie I've seen. Next, yes, it's the 45th anniversary, I believe, right now, Jaws. And the cool thing about Jaws is it starts off as a horror movie, but kind of moves into an adventure film. But just think, the movie came out in 1975, and people are still afraid to go into the ocean. We know only like five people are even attacked, not even killed every year by sharks, but we're still afraid to go into the water 40 something years later. That's astounding. And so that was a close one for me for Scariest. I'm gonna cheat a little bit with this next one and pick a TV show, and that's The Haunting of Hill House. I love this show. It's one of my favorite series of all time. No kidding. <laughs> no kidding in a horror video. This show really did genuinely scare me the first time I watched it. It was in a great way and I loved every moment of it. It wasn't scary in a way that turned me off to it. But since we're talking about film, I couldn't pick a show, but I did want to throw an honorable mention of that in there. But let me throw this. If you're familiar with my channel and me, you know Alien would probably be the scariest movie I've watched. Now, looking back on it today, obviously movies are completely different than what that was, but Alien is a film that the first time I watched it bored me in the first 10 minutes, so I turned it off, but then came back to it a couple years later after a recommendation from a friend, and completely grateful and thankful that I did, because now it's one of my favorite movies of all time. The amazing thing about this film is I believe the alien has five minutes or less of screen time in this film. And that is, in my opinion, what makes it so scary. You spend almost the entire runtime of this film looking for the monster and being terrified of where this alien is. And I think that and what it did for cinema and movie making is why I want to pick this as the scariest movie I've seen. I can only imagine what it was like to watch this movie back in 1977 and be in a dark, loud, crowded theater and just feel so overwhelmed with fear. I would love to have been there for that. And that's why I want to pick Alien for the scariest movie I've seen. Once again, don't forget to comment down below with your pick for your the scariest film that you have seen. Tomorrow, when we come back, we're going to be talking about a film that I've always wanted to see, but have never seen. And so this one's going to be fun, and I'm looking forward to it. Thank you for sticking around to the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to like it. Make sure you're subscribed so you can come back to participate tomorrow and share it with someone who you know will enjoy it just as much as you did. Thank you again, and I'll see you tomorrow. Shh. <laughs>